It's another sizzling hot summer day here in Korea, with temperatures hovering above 30 degrees Celsius across the country. And today, it's also Chobok, the first day of the hottest period of summer, and people here in Korea have their own ways to beat the heat. Our Sobobin tells us more. Seoul's first heat wave warning of the year was issued on Monday as the daytime high soared to a sweltering 34 degrees Celsius. However, such temperatures at this time of the year aren't out of the ordinary in Korea. In fact, Koreans mark the coming of midsummer with a series of days based on the lunar calendar, and Tuesday is known as Chobok, the start of a long period of scorching weather that hits Korea between July and August. During this time of the year, many Koreans tend to eat healthy foods to give them the energy to cope with heat. One of the popular dishes is samgyetang, a soup made with chicken and ginseng. Many people search at samgyetang restaurants, but this year was extra special for the older residents of Seoul's Dongdaemunggu district. There was a samgyetang sharing event provided for elderly residents to keep them cool. In our community, in celebration of Chobok, we have laid on this event to help our older residents enjoy a healthy summer. Many elderly men and women gathered at the Imundong Community Service Center to enjoy a free bowl of samgyetang to give them the energy to fight off the heat. I feel very energetic and strong. Samgyetang is the best for Koreans. In Korea, People try to beat the heat in various ways, but with several more weeks of intense temperatures and high humidity expected, a few more bowls of samgyetang might do the trick. Sobobin, Arirang News.